Oh my word. Oh my word. I'm broken. That has actually broken me a little bit. I'm not going to lie. Okay, let's get this over with. I'm recording this straight after finishing recording the last episode, which you'll have seen by now. You'll have seen my minor meltdown. I'm going to get straight into the games because, if I'm honest, I kind of want to get the season over with. It's been rubbish. It's been so disheartening. You, you, you all know what it's like when you just you get a terrible run of form and no matter what you do, you just can't seem to turn it round. It's, it's so maddening. It is maddeningly annoying. Maddeningly annoying? Is that a thing? I haven't said hello yet. Hello everyone, welcome back to Faded Sam FM with me, my name is Chris, hope you're doing well. I'll get that out quick. So today, today, we've got the second leg of the Fuller Derby against Grurud, and then we've got a game against Start, who are, you know, I think they got relegated last season, didn't they? Yes, they did, so they're going to absolutely destroy us. We're sticking with the 4-4-1-1. We're sticking with it. Storv's back in goal. Skevstad, never, never again, not after that ridiculous attempted clearance claimy thing he did at the end of last episode. I find everyone who finished the match with a rating lower than 6.5. That made Hofstad really, really annoyed at me. So he absolutely hates me at the moment, which is fine. I hate him too. I hate all of them, actually. And Helm, you need to score, but you're not going to get the chance to today because you're starting on the bench because you can't score because you're rubbish. It's possibly not the best idea to record this straight after that mini meltdown because I'm still heated. First highlight of the game goes Gururud's way. Ostad has it. Elmi back to Sagan. Sagan. Akin. Akinimi. Uh, Storz has come out from his goal. You, you just can't. You can't make. You cannot make that up. What is he doing? <laughs> I don't. I can't. I don't. I can't. I don't. I haven't. I've got nothing for you. I don't understand why a goalkeeper would think that that was ever a good idea in a million years. Why would that be a good idea? Oh, Stad for Garud. Fredrickson's picked up a knock and I haven't noticed. Elmi is on the ball. Sargon, Akinimi, Sariba is in. It's two. It's two nil. Fantastic. I love it. Two. Right. Right. I'll tell you what we're going to do. I tell you, bugger it. I'll tell you what we're going to do. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to go classic, classic Gagan press. 4 2 3 1 DMAMY. No, I don't want to say the current tactic because it's rubbish. Uh, right, we'll put Saul in there. Good. Yeah, we'll go. Fine. Whatever. You know, we'll use we'll use the um we'll use the preset because apparently I can't do tactics anymore. Doesn't doesn't matter, does it? We'll just we'll just you you know 4 2 3 1 Gagan press. That's 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 what works. Salt header hits the crossbar. God damn, I'm angry. <laughs> I haven't been this salty at Football Manager in a long time. Like a long time. A long time? Maybe since sometime in the last manager's journey. I'm not even going to bother making any substitutions. I'm not going to talk to them. They can figure it out themselves. I'm just going to rant at you for the next couple of minutes. And you can watch the highlights in the background. We've got a free kick. Bertini stands over it. I, I guess I'm talking about it as well. Bertini shoots. Can't score. Cannot score. We cannot score. We're incapable of scoring goals. We're incapable of defending. We've got goalkeepers who are utter utter cretins and we're out of the playoff spot it's great it's great we're losing the fuller derby as well wow it's 1-1 in the fuller derby we're not really losing it we've had 11 shots three on target more of the ball it's been better funnily enough since we started using the preset um so despite having players that cannot play gagan press if you stare to gagan press you, you you know you do okay uh Erson Sullivan, 6.1 we'll bring on our other really shite striker in andreas helm on he comes in a minute Saul Crespo gives the ball to Bettini. Bettini plays in Lil Lovo. Lil Lovo to Ersenson. Ersenson scores! I've just taken him off. Ersenson scores. It's 2-1. Right, Andreas Hellem can come on now. Grab the, the, the equaliser. Maybe. Who knows? Yeah, bring him on anyway. Bring him on. Why not? Why not? Bettini. Free kick. Swings it in. Salt. Header. It's 2-2. Two, two. We've equalised. Brilliant. Mm. Oh my god. Right. Right. Oh, was he offside? Was he offside? He was offside. He was offside. There it is. There it is. Can't have the good. Can't have happy. Can't have good. No, no. It's offside. You, you can't. Oh, and they're in now. They're three, three. Is it three now? Yeah. Oh, killer itch. Good block. I need to calm down. Lil Lovo. Fredrickson. Kabai out on the right hand side. Is he getting a cross in? He's not. Oh, my word. What, what nearly happened there? What nearly happened there? That was. Mm. Good. Ness for Grorud gives it to Faraba. I've calmed down a little bit. I think I think it's fine, you know. Life's too short. Life is too short, isn't it? And uh, if we keep going at that clip, I'll have an absolute 
like heart do I want to say I'll have a heart attack I don't think I'll have a heart attack but it won't be good we've lost again we've lost I'm not talking to them I'm no longer doing team talks I haven't lost the dressing room they've lost the manager uh 423 on Gagan Press for the game against Star I'm not even going to attempt to do anything tactically uh I've, quick pick the, the assistant managers pick the team for me we've got so many players out and so many players injured and so many players hate me as much as I hate them that uh, it doesn't really matter who I pick does it Storves keeps his place in goal because the other option is just as rubbish Andreas Hellam starts why not bugger it why not why not right no not talking to you get out there you've lost me not I haven't lost you you've lost me oh it's Pell Rude he's uh he's he's, he's got his deb not his debut his second debut mine says that a penalty no, of course that's not a penalty. Some of the penalties that I've not gotten and have been given against me, hmm, ridiculous. Mena is just running through our entire team. Arflot is in. Arflot shoots, nearly scores. It's a good block. Bettini over this free kick swings it in and it's cleared away. As far as Saul Crespo gives it back to Bettini. Bettini out wide, cuts inside, gives it back to Saul Crespo who loses the ball. Arflot, how? What? Where is our defence? Where did our defence go there? It's 1 0. Good. Great. Where, 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 where was our defence? Where was our defence? I've got to look at it again. Why? <laughs> oh God, I've actually lost my mind. That's good. Brilliant. Um, ten seconds. Ten seconds. Right. Hang on a minute. We had. We've got two defenders. We've got Gedimini and Palerud right at the back. Gedimini and Palerud are both there, easily covering this R flop dickhead. Bettini gives it to Saul Crespo, who loses the ball. That right there, okay, fine. Is he not offside? Is he not massively offside? We'll just watch this this bollocks again, right? Right. Saul Crespo's got the ball. Our flot is currently onside. Let's slow this right bloody down. Right. Our flot's currently onside. Saul Crespo's got the ball. Saul Crespo loses the ball. Our flot is now massively offside if that isn't overturned then i don't know what to do he is though isn't he i'm not i'm not off i'm not insane that, that like i've got a mouse's cursor width there you cannot say that's onside cannot absolutely not i'm gonna go back to live was it disallowed was it but oh my god oh my god that was never offside oh what how was that onside? It's 2 0. How was that onside? Uh, oh, God. This might be the last episode of this season because I, I can't. Oh, my God. I can't. I can't. I'll see, at the, I'll see you at the end of the game. I'll see you at the end of the game. I'll see you at the end of the game. Otherwise, um, uh, it's fine. We're going to look at it again. <laughs> <We're>, <laughs> I, I, I refuse to accept this. I refuse to accept this. We're going to go 2D as well. But let's um, rewind this. Right, Saul Crespo. Onside. He is onside. Fair player. Hang on, let me get... No, I've just got to get, get, get the settings right. Right, here we go. Here we go. We'll go really slow. Right, he's onside. Here. Saul Crespo has the ball. So we play it. Right, Saul Crespo has lost the ball. Here. Is, is it the match engine? Like... Because he's offside there, or is he just on? I think he's just on there. I wonder if it's the match engine making it look like he hasn't yet played the pass. Right, here we go. Here we go. Right, 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 right. He is now offside. There, he is offside. He is definitely offside. That is offside. The ball is not being played. He is offside. And now the ball is played. How on earth? The referee is right there. The lino is right. Mm. How on earth? How on earth? How the actual how? Right, how do I get out of this? There we go. Right, dressing room. I'm so angry at that. I'm so angry. I'm so angry. I'm not going to play the rest of this season. I'm resigning. I'm, res I'm leaving Arundel. I'm doing it right now. Resign immediately. Yeah, okay. there's no way that that's going to get any better. But if we stay here next season, or well not now anyway, because I've just done it. If we were to stay here next season, there's no way that gets any better because we've got no money. We can't attract professional players because we've got no money, because we're not professional. <laughs> Crikey, Mikey. I mean, that that offside goal 
has genuinely broken me. That is worse, worse than the FM thing we got against Oslo. Unbelievable. I, I, I'm astounded that that has happened. Absolutely. I'm not saying that that's the reason why we're terrible. That's not. It's just an extra kick in the teeth, isn't it? To get to 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 have the first goal that we concede in that game be a clear offside, a clear offside, just yeah, it oh, just right, right. Oh my word! Oh my word! I'm broken. That has actually broken me a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. That run of form from August onwards or June onwards has destroyed me. And then that offside goal. Just the cherry on the cake of doom. I'll see you in the next episode. We might be a manager of a different club, or we might still be unemployed. I don't know yet. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if me losing my goddamn marbles on camera isn't enjoyable, and I'll try and I'll try and calm down a little bit. But um, sometimes, sometimes you just can't keep calm, and you know that's fine. It's fine. Let me know what you thought down in the comments. Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you soon for the next step of the manager's journey. That definitely won't be at Arundel. All the best. Cheers. Bye. What? What? What?